20 minutes before 12 o'clock. Joe Martone is in the studio. It's time to have fun with Joe. And because of the Silver Springs International Film Festival, I have all Alugas. movie questions. Oh, movie questions. Yep. Now, what I will do is I will tell you the plot of a movie, and then your job is to tell me the name of the movie. Should be fun. I think you'll do good on this one. This is one I think you'll both do good on. <laughs> he says that all the <laughs> no, time. No, I didn't say it yesterday. That science quiz I thought was going to be hard. but I It think... wasn't. Jim, Jim and Pete were, were great at it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, hold, yeah. you held your own, too, so you did pretty good. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> We've got two $35 tickets to the Silver Springs International Film Festival, and these are good for the 10th of April because it starts today. Today is the 8th. <laughs> oh, sorry. Friday. <laughs> I am so far ahead. I was I am like two days ahead of Don't myself. Don't push now. the wig, lady. <laughs> <laughs> Don't push the wig. He goes fast enough. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> mm. So anyway, as I was saying, from 11 a.m. on, on the 10th, which is Friday. Friday. <laughs> $235 tickets for there. So come by and pick those up. They are here, right here, right there. And from Bob White's Camellia Gardens, a $20 gift certificate for Bob White's Camellia Gardens and the vegetables they have there also since 1952. They've been doing it correctly. <laughs> I hope so. Well, wait, if you grow it, you got to grow it right or don't grow, grow it right. at all. Yep, yep. That's it. Robin, a disclaimer, please. If you or anyone in your household has won fun with Joe in the past 30 days, you are ineligible to play today. Ineligible, I tell you. All right. Yep. This is the, one of the hottest, tic- uh, the hottest tickets in town of these movie, international movie festival tickets. So I uh, hope you win one or two of them. Two of them, right? We'll give them two. Right? two. That's $70 worth. All right. 622 9622. We need two players. One to bet on Joe, one to bet on Robin. If you bet on the winner, then you are the winner and you get the entire prize package. We'll take a break and take your calls during the break. The number again, 622-9622. We'll be right back. The weather is brought to you by MyFWC.com. Safe boating is no accident for today. A warm day with sunshine and some building clouds. There can be an afternoon thunderstorm in spots. High 82 at the coast, 87 inland. And partly cloudy tonight, though 63 to 67. Mostly sunny and pleasantly warm tomorrow. High 83 on the coast, 89 inland. For Friday, partly sunny and warm. Watch out for a thunderstorm in the afternoon. The high 85 to 89. From the Florida Weather Center, I'm meteorologist Joe Lundberg. Your weekends are getting a little retool. Swear to God, not making a joke. Check this out. New shows? Check. We are on board. Some new talent. Check. Let's welcome the guys. Let's get it going. Arnie Spanier. Unbelievable. TJ Reeves. This is what you get. <laughs> Your weekends are on fire. Because that's how exotic it is. We are on Get it for less at the DIY Home Center Outlet. Get top quality real wood cabinets the same or less than the big box stores are selling the cheap stuff. And that's not all. Drywall screws big box stores are $6.47 a pound at DIY only $4.99. Plus DIY has the largest selection of mobile home parts and accessories anywhere. From carpet to doors, get the DIY supplies you need for less. The DIY Home Center Outlet. We are your building material closeout store. 2191 Northwest 10th Street, just two miles east of I-75. Are you tired of not using your home's outdoor space for entertaining or relaxation because of all the bugs and leaves? Consider adding a beautiful screen room or glass enclosure. We are Superior Aluminum and Design, a family-owned and operated business with 20 years' experience in the aluminum industry. And we are accredited by the Better Business Bureau. If you appreciate superior workmanship, call Superior Aluminum and Design at 817-8058 or visit us on the web at superioraluminumdesign.com. All right, 15 minutes before 12 o'clock, we have our players. Are starting up already, Larry? We're talking away over Nancy's here. Nancy's betting on you, Joe, and Phyllis is betting on Robin. Yep. Well, we're not, we're not, not paying attention to you, Larry. We're just paying attention <laughs> we're to chatting. us. We're just paying attention to us. All right, so here we go. Yeah. This is this is going to be a fun one, I think. I think you would get this, right? I All right, I'm going to so. give you the plot of a movie. You tell me the name of the movie. Okay. Here's the plot. As the plot thickens. A young cop must save the passengers of a bus that has a bomb set to explode. Speed. If- 
Speed is right. If the bus Ooh, goes fifty Phyllis. below fifty miles an hour. <laughs> All right, next one. Next and, one would be nice. An yeah. African prince goes to Queens, New York City, to find a wife whom he can respect oh, for Eddie her Murphy, in, uh, intelligence uh, yeah. and will. Oh, Eddie Murphy did that one. Uh, the trading places. No, 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 no. no, um, no. Oh gosh! Well, I can Initials, see please. C T A. Coming to America. Coming to America is right. Oh, wow. Good job. All right, right. Here's the next. Coming to America. Here's the next uh, plot. Land of opportunity. I'm surprised they didn't use that in the movie. Yeah, really. Well, they had to pay royalties probably. An emotionally self-destructive boxer's journey through life as the violence and temper that Rocky. leads him. No. Oh. Leads him to the top in the ring, destroys his life outside of it. Was it white something? No. Very famous movie. Oh, yes, yes. Or De Niro. Was it De Niro? Oh, on yes. the waterfront? It's De Niro. It's De Niro. Uh, Not wa- on the waterfront. No. Oh, something it's horse. Something. Uh, no, no. no horse on that one. Come on, do you want to take. Raging Bulls. Raging, Raging Bulls, Bulls, right? Yeah, yes. yes. Like an and the point? Well, Jim the Bulldozer is going to help Joe, so I got to help Robin. <laughs> Okie doke, too, for Phyllis. <laughs> hey. I'm seeing Joe. Hey. The next film is a film that explores the dark and miserable Ooh. town Basin City and tells the story of three different people all caught up in the violent corruption of the city. Sin City. Sin City is right. Wow. You didn't even hesitate with that one. Yeah. Well, he <laughs> finished it before you We're jumped tied. in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. Dur- during her son's college graduation, Jane hooks up with her ex-husband, Jake, who's married to a younger woman. Oh, gosh. That's with... Uh, that's not The Graduate, no. Uh, that's no. with uh, uh, Steve Martin and... Uh, what? Alec Baldwin and uh, Meryl Streep. Oh, my God. What is... Uh, no, uh, that wasn't... That wasn't I don't know. Oh, I don't know who God. the actors what are. What is the name of that? Alec Baldwin was the ex-husband. Meryl Ooh. Streep and... Well, initials will try. I see. Uh, oh, it's... Uh, Oh my gosh! I can't remember the name of this movie. <laughs> oh my gosh! Uh, Interception considerably. In the, <laughs> oh gosh, uh, I can't remember. Colin. Right, Phyllis, nobody's Colin helping, Nancy. and you don't seem to know. It's complicated. It's complicated. Okay, but what's that's the name it. of the movie? <laughs> that's it. Yeah. Those All right. Are the the next one. A humble orphan suddenly becomes oh. a gentleman with the help of an unknown benefactor. Oliver. No. Yeah, that would be a good one, though. No. Ooga. Annie. <laughs> no, oh, that's our lady from the... Yes. Uh, yeah, she's from... Uh, good morning, you're on the air. What do you think? Oh, is secret. Is it Great Expectations? Yes, Great Expectations. Wow. Yes, good and the, job. Well, that's for Robin, yes. You're a dick you say. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thank you, Pete. Thank you. All right, a high school boy is given the chance to write a story for Rolling Stone magazine about an up-and-coming rock band as he accompanies it on their concert tour. Oh, yeah. Copy Boy. Company's damage, I should say. Copy Boy? No. Because no. he actually plays the guitar in there and starts getting swept up. He's got that curly hair and the... Really? The Pete, what's his name, look to him. The initials were... AF. Oh, my gosh. AF. I can't remember the name of the movie. Call it I know Phyllis. it has a good soundtrack. That's all I know about this movie. Come on, do you know? American Family. No way there. Okay. Uh, no, not American Family. It's almost famous. That's almost it. famous. Oh, that's the one. That's Here's another movie the one I've seen. plot. Tell me the the <laughs> movie title. When an asteroid the size of Texas is headed for Earth, the oh, world Armageddon. Armageddon is right. Okay, I snuck that one in on Joe. <laughs> <laughs> snuck it right in there. All right, the next one. Uh, Bagheera and Panther and Baloo the Bear have a difficult time trying Jungle to Book. Jungle Book is Good right. Job. The bear gave it away. <laughs> a private detective takes on a case that involves him with three eccentric criminals, a gorgeous liar, and their quest for a priceless statuette. Dick Tracy? No. The Pink uh, Panther? No. The statuette is really a big the clue. The librarian? No. Come on, do you know? The Maltese Falcon. Maltese Falcon oh, is right. That, yeah, you know, I had a picture oh, of that in my gosh. head. And the point? Robin. There you uh, go. Killing me here. All right. All right. <laughs> this is a musical about two youngsters from rival New York City gangs who fall in love. West Side Story. West Side Story is yeah. right. 
This is a movie about an Iowa corn farmer hearing voices, and he interprets them as a command. Oh, fill the dreams. To, yes, to build Ooh, a baseball diamond. I'm tired now, five to five. I have to do something. You're getting help I know, all this time. I know, you're just getting right there. I know, I'm getting help. The next... <laughs> <laughs> Two against one, that's not good. The next plot says, Robert Gould Shaw leads the U.S. Civil War's first all-black volunteer company, fighting prejudices of both his own Union Army and the Confederates. Oh. That was Ke- with Kevin Costner. The, uh... The initials? It's a one-word title. Starts it's, with G. Oh, G. Glory. Oh, good what? job. Glory. Glory is right. You got it before. Glory is right. Glory. <laughs> a mousy and abused girl with telekinetic powers gets pushed too far one special night. Carrie. Carrie is right. Uh, okay. Yes. Okay. We're tied. Uh, this next movie is the story of George Jung, the man who established... George what? Jung. <laughs> oh, Jung. Okay. The man who established the American <laughs> cocaine market in the 1970s. Scarface? No. Say hello, one, to, say one hello to my little friend. It's a one-word title. Starts with the letter B. B- Ooh. B. <laughs> what did you all say? A female dog. I almost said. I didn't say it. Good oh. morning. Do you know? Is it Blow? It is Blow. Yes. Oh, oh. I saw that movie. And who's the point for? I saw Blow. Yeah. For Joe. For Joe, Joe gets Blow. blow get, Joe gets Blow. Mm. Okay, thank yeah. you. Thank you very much. <laughs> I didn't see a movie called Blow. Say hello to my little friend. No, I did, because that was Victor's other film. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Jeepers Creepers? The one that did Jeepers Creepers? I saw this movie? Yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. We're not sitting around the... To see it. So, All right. So. Greed, <laughs> deception, money, power, and murder occur between two mobster best friends and a trophy wife over a gambling empire. Casino? Casino is right. Whoa. See, I knew you guys would get this one. Yeah. Uh, Here's another plot. A hapless New York advertising executive is mistaken for a government agent by a shady organization and is pursued across the country while he looks for a way to survive. Oh, my God. Pink Panther? No. Come on, do you know? It's your fallback? North by Northwest. North by Northwest is right. Oh, we're going. Okay. If he had said the year, that probably would have helped. I don't know the years. And the point? Yeah, the year is 2015, and the point is for Robin. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you, will, you will pay for that. You will pay for that. All right, the next uh, plot says, Pledgling writer Brioni Tallis, as a 13-year-old, irrevocably changes the course of several lives when she accuses her older sister's lover of a crime he did not commit. You got that one? <laughs> 13 going on 30? Do you want me to read it to you again? No, yeah. once was okay. enough. Fledgling writer Brioni Tallis. Why? Why are you rolling your eyes? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I won't read it again. Thank you. Initials. A. That's the initial. Yeah, that, that, that's a letter. That's it? A? Well, what is an Anonymous. initial? Anonymous. Is an initial a letter? Yeah, yes. That's true. Anonymous? No. Mm. A. A is the letter. A. The first letter, which I consider to be the initial. <laughs> 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 it's ah, true. It ooga. is the initial. Hey, Larry. Ah, ooga. Hey. Oh, my gosh. Uh, what could that be? Amazed? No. Hmm. Afraid? It, oh, my gosh. No. Mm. Afterthought. It's her name, isn't it? <laughs> Do you know what this movie's about? Heck no, no, I have no clue. I wonder why. I have no idea. <laughs> because you didn't want me to read it over oh, again. Oh, I got it the first time. I still know what it's about. Oh, well, that tells you what it's about. Do you know what it's about? Arson? All right, try it again. <laughs> Is it uh, arson? It's atonement. 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 Yeah, that would have helped me. He could have said the whole thing three times. All right. The next uh-huh. movie, a Las Vegas set comedy centered around three groomsmen who lose their about to hangover. be. Hangover. The hangover is right. Good the job. Right. A down and out golfer attempts to recover his game and his Chip life. Cup. No. Bagger Van. Vance Bagger. Yes, Vance the Bagger legend Bagger. of Bagger, Bagger Vance, Vance is Bagger right. Vance. Vance. Baggy pants. The legend baggy of pants. baggy pants. <laughs> There was one guy that had some. He walked like a penguin when he went in here. Oh, those are real baggy pants. Yeah, they were really low. With they, a with they, a childhood tragedy that overshadowed their lives, three ooh. men are reunited by circumstance when one loses a daughter. Oh, that's that Sean Penn movie, Green River. It's something river, but not green. Moon oh, River. Oh, gee. No. Uh, it's with Sean Penn. That was Green such, River, oh. Moon River, Red River, Green River. Good know. morning, do you know? Mystic River. Mystic is right. Yes. The point? Robin. Ah! You're you're to killing the me. You're killing I don't me. think Jim's listening right now. He's not calling in. Well, Stan Kenton passed away. 
Stan Freeberg. Oh, Stan Freeberg. Right, right. Oh, you think so Jim's Stan. in mourning? Yeah. <laughs> Could be. Uh, at the end he of his, be in his car, I don't know where he is. At the end of his career, yes. a, a clueless fashion model is brainwashed to kill the prime minister of Malaysia. <laughs> Uh, first letter of the first Z. One. Zorba the Greek. <laughs> no. Good guess. One, Zorro. It's a one word answer. Well, Zorro's one word. It is. Zumba? Good morning, you know. That's exercise. Zoolander. <laughs> Zoolander is right. Oh, that was okay, yeah. <laughs> and the point? Yeah. Woo! I got a, I got a chuckle point. Ten for Nancy, oh, 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 oh. Joe. Nine for me and fellas. All right. Homer's epic poem, The Odyssey, set in the Deep South during the 1930s. In it, three escaped convicts search for hidden treasure while a relentless lawman push, pursues them. Oh, gee, that's uh, George Clooney and the other two guys on that. <laughs> that train car that you yeah that, that was with. a funny that was a funny scene they all went in except one and the other one pulled them all back mind you now oh brother where are they That's oh brother ah, where are they oh brother and, <laughs> and the point for Joe yeah. I got a point Dr. Richard Kimball. Oh, gee, the fugitive. The fugitive. Okay, the fugitive is right you That's all me. I had to read to see was yeah, the name that's it, that's it, yeah, yeah. Uh, this next one is a biopic depicting the Who? a biopic what is a biopic? <laughs> it's a story. A, oh, why don't you say that then? Uh, all right, it's a story depicting the <laughs> early years of legendary director and aviator Howard Hughes's career from the late 1920s through the mid 1940s. Oh, that's what that Titanic guy. <laughs> is it Howard? Was it uh? Starts with a what? With uh, an A. With an A again. Aviator. The aviator, aviator is right. The aviator. The aviator is or right. Or Tigan, 11. Uh, 11. Wow. Boom, 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 All right, this is the story of the undersized Depression era racehorse whose victories lifted not only the oh, spirits oh, of the team oh, behind yes. it, but also those of the nation. Uh, the Secretariat? No. 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 Uh, oh, oh, oh. Is it's there it's, an Ocala connection with this? Yes. Yeah. Oh, we spoke to the author of this. Yes. Book. Come, uh, on, come on, do you know? Seabiscuit. Seabiscuit. That's, That's the one. Oh, there is, Jim. Out of mourning and from, from Joe gets the, Joe gets the point. There there you go. Go. Thank, Thank you, you Jim. Okay. Glad to hear from you. All right. His phone needed a battery charge. This There's is an phone. English professor named John Keating who inspires his students oh. to a love of poetry. Well, your hand up in the air. Oh, it's the Robin Ring Williams the bell movie. and to seize the day. It's the Robin Williams movie. It's yes. the, the right. poet, Dead the Poet Society. Dead Poet Society is right. Yes. Now we're tying in. Ugh. Twelve to twelve. In twentieth century colonial Kenya. A Danish baroness plantation owner has a passionate but ultimately doomed love affair with a free-spirited big game hunter. Uh, initial? I'll try initial. O-O-A. O-O-A. Gosh. <laughs> Ooh, uh, Ooh. Is that a Google again? Good morning, do you know? Out of Africa. Out of Africa. Oh, that was so simple. That, that is one of the few chick movies I really like, and give the point to Robin. Please. Thank you. Thank 15 you. for Phyllis, 12 for Nancy uh, and Joe. All right, the next one. A young single mother and textile worker agrees to Norma. help. Norma. Norma Ray. Norma Ray is right. Ooh, good job. A TV network cynically exploits a deranged ex-TV anchor's ravings and revelations about the media for their own profit. Network? Network is right. Oh. Don't a, make fun of me anymore. You <laughs> a pre-revolutionary Russia, a poor Jewish peasant must... I'm sorry, in pre-revolutionary... Fiddler on the roof. Fiddler on the roof is right. Where yeah. the heck do you get Fiddler on the roof? On the <laughs> <laughs> a somewhat romanticized account of the <sighs> career of the notoriously violent bank-robbing couple and their gang. Bonnie and Clyde. Bonnie and Clyde is right. All right. Epic story of a mysterious stranger with a harmonica who joins forces <laughs> with a notorious desperado to protect a beautiful widow from a ruthless assassin working for the railroad. Oh my He's God. got a harmonica, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hit you with my harmonica. You get near my... Oh, oh my God. This harmonica is going to... Every time, every time you pass win, you're going to play a game. You're going to play a tune every time you pass win. All right. Win. The movie is called Sarah Una Volta Il West. Told you pass when you pass exactly. if you get it. I heard that one. Let's do this again tomorrow. Who wins? Who wins? Uh, Phyllis wins with 15. Nancy Dang and Joe have 14. So oh. neck there. The harmonica the prize, did so. me in. Yeah. <laughs> Broadcasting from the Paddock Mall Studios, this is WO.